birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy but things are finally right the future is bright. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It's Belinda Celine, and for today's video, I wanted to do a party prep, party inspiration video on my baby shower. I got so many messages over on Instagram asking if I could do this and luckily I did film it but I just got a chance to get all the footage together since I used different cameras and I finally found it. So here it is and I decided to go with a classic Winnie the Pooh theme because I love Disney so much and I thought this was just so cute especially the classic Winnie the Pooh. So I'm going to share with you guys a few items that I made myself and it is including this sign right here which we posted outside so that people were redirected to go to the backyard and just where we were having the baby shower. So I want it to be customized. I found the graphic over on Etsy. I feel like you can find anything that you need when it comes to DIY projects over on Etsy. And I just went ahead and I blew this up and printed it with several different sticker paper. That way I can go ahead and cut it into pieces and put it together almost like a jigsaw puzzle. And I will say it was a lot harder than I thought it was. I used Microsoft Word to be able to do it. So if you guys have that program or something similar, I'm pretty sure you could do it as well. And then I went ahead and I just used an old box that I could put it on. That way it would be sturdy and it won't blow away. And then I went ahead on my Pika machine and made the letters that said Baby Vega. Using those same graphics, I also customized a few other things like this right here and this is where the diaper raffle box would be. So I placed it on the table next with some sticky note paper and also a marker just so that in case people forgot their diaper raffle ticket that they can go ahead and add it in here. We love Disney in this house and I really wanted to have a fun Disney game. And this one right here I found on Etsy as well and it was super easy to print out and I just went ahead and I cut it myself and these were really really hard. I do recommend this game. Nobody got all of them right and I thought it was going to be so easy. Now for the prizes, I wanted to make them really really special and since the majority are women who come to baby showers, I wanted to include a bunch of goodies on here. So all different kinds of makeup products, hair products, and makeup brushes, and just a bunch of fun stuff. So I wish I could find the footage of me making these bags because I actually personalized them myself. I found the white bags on Amazon and I wanted them to be see-through so that people can pick their own prize if they liked what was featured like in the front. And I went ahead and on my Cricut machine, I blew up some of the images that I got from Etsy and then I put them on sticker paper so that way I can go ahead and customize these bags. And I wish I had that footage because it showed like in detail how I did it. So many of you guys asked how I made these bags and then I also made a sticker that says that it was our baby shower. So I was so excited about these. These would make great party favor bags if you have different kinds of parties just depending on what you want and I stayed up really late at night putting these together. So Ricardo went off to bed and I stayed up until like 1 or 2 o'clock um, in the morning putting these together but it was so much fun and then I found all of the tissue paper at the dollar store so it was quite inexpensive. The bags were also a good decent price and I'll have all of that linked down in the description box below along with any supplies that I used. 
For the majority of our decorations, I hired Elena. She makes these beautiful balloon garlands, as you can see, and she also has a bunch of different rentals that you can use and props for your parties. And she did an amazing job of coming up, setting it up quickly, making it look absolutely beautiful, and bringing all the stuff with her. It was really windy, and I'm surprised that all of these did make it through the windy day. And she also put together these cute little bundles of balloons to hang the stuffed animals that, that I got from Amazon and I got pretty much the majority of the things from Amazon including the tents where these are hanging from and the tent was worth it it only took like four people to just prop and set it up it didn't require too much assembling and they did it quite quickly so it was really awesome it just pulls apart and then I'm over here setting up at the dessert table which took me a while to get it down because it was super windy but I also bought the backdrop and everything that you're gonna see over on Amazon and I did this maybe within a week's notice <laughs> the only thing that I do recommend is to get a bigger backdrop than what I have here I didn't read the description very well when it came to how big that was but overall it turned out really well and it was so beautiful and it looks great in pictures now let me show you guys how the dessert table came together so on the sides I have the prizes and then I bought these little honeycombs from Target all the desserts including the cake pops, the cupcake strawberries, and the cake are all from Mariela and she makes such beautiful desserts. I will have all of the vendors and their information down in the description box below if you guys live local and need someone to make your desserts. And then over here I just have the prizes set up along with some of the games that I have from the beginning like don't say baby which you just grab a clothespin put it on and then whoever collects the most clothespins by the end of the day they win a prize along with a diaper raffle and I set it all up together so it was definitely worth getting all those graphics from Etsy so I can put all this together and the backdrop is also from Amazon including the stand so it was super easy to put together it was a bit of a challenge with the wind but overall it turned out so good good The cake topper is also from Amazon and I love that it has like a very neutral wooden theme to it because I love all the soft colors from all the different decorations. This was my favorite game, and between Katie, Sandy, and I, we all made up this game together. So they ceramic wrap a watermelon across their body, which held up pretty well, actually. And they had to get up from the floor, because we all know that's super difficult to do in your third trimester, put on their shoes. And some people got it really quick, and some people took a little bit longer. Some people who were not used to having <laughs> Um, the huge weight on them and then you had to go grab the baby give it to your partner and your partner had to race back and change a diaper blindfolded all while hushing the baby to make sure that the baby didn't cry some of them dropped the baby but that's okay and then <laughs> they went ahead and they changed the dirty diapers and we just used some old dolls with some newborn pampers and then they went ahead and put them on there and then they had to race back and whoever got there first, all intact and on time, then won. And as you could tell, Jorge and Renee were the winners. They're so funny. And the other two guys, <laughs> they didn't know that they were getting beaten. But it was so much fun to watch. It was hilarious, especially if you know them um, personally. And just like to see what they would do. It was hilarious. We all had such a great time and we loved it. And it was so fun to watch. The boys had a great time, they were good sportsmen, and we had so much fun watching them. So it was a really fun game, I highly recommend it, and it gave them a little preview of what it's like to be pregnant. I heard one of them say their back was hurting, and I'm like, tell me about it. All that weight sure does hurt your back. Everything turned out so great, and I could have done it without my family and my friends to help with everything, because it 
planning a party could be a lot, <laughs> especially coming up with like the games and all of that stuff. So we had so much fun and I am just so thankful for all of my loved ones who were here and I have my sweet little niece and nephew helping us all of the gifts and then sweet little baby Benji my cute little baby if you guys didn't know and if you guys are new to my channel we do have a 10 month old baby and he will be one years old by the time this baby comes so they might have the same birth date we'll see but he also got a few gifts and he loves books so much and cars and look at his excited little face <laughs> he was so happy to see the cars inside the book but I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll talk to you guys next time which is besos Mwah. <laughs>